Look at that. It's like dog fights. Is that that camera I got you? Uh, no, you, the camera you got me was a blue one. Yeah, what happened to that one? Uh, it's inside. Still got it? Yeah. Of course I still got it. I, I had it for like two days. Look at that, it's like a dog fight, except nobody's betting on anybody. Nobody's trained them or anything. That's like, that's like common knowledge to them. So we got ourselves some kites. It's a nice day, so we decided to, you know, fly them. It's got like a little sea turtle thing going on. We got Iron Man. Oh yeah, that is nice. Oh, there we go. It's a very nice, cool, nice, cool breeze going on. I just saw the movie Forrest Gump for the first time. And it's officially in one of the... It definitely deserved those six Academy Awards. It was amazing. I haven't... I never really watched Forrest Gump before. Because I never really had the chance to, but now that I did... It's it's very nice. Look at him. It's like a little kid again. <laughs> All right. Hello, and welcome to Cleaning the Closet with Dante, where we don't come out of the closet, we just clean it. I've been doing some thinking, and I realized that it's time for me to finally get organized with myself, and finally, you know, get rid of some of this junk. And, well... Let's get started. First off, we got these nice sleeveless gloves. These are good for like, oh look, ionic gloves. These are mainly good for riding bikes, but they're also good for, you know, apocalypse movies or writing codes, but you know. They're, that's all they're pretty much good for is either a props to a movie or you know riding bikes it, once you're like the professional bike riders instead of like a normal bike rider next we got these weird arm band things I have no idea what these are for these are probably just for like yeah, I don't know what these are for. Maybe they're for like suit of armor type of stuff. I'll probably just donate these. <laughs> Put them in the donate pile. Uh, let's see. This is a folder for the heck. Oh, shoot. Okay. Huh. This is my Albertsons thing and my Nova thing. But other than that, this is pretty... Oh, look at that! I still had the little signature. Basically, I got a couple of folders, and they are both going in the trash. Let's see. Ooh! Some of my comic books. Let's see. We got a Rick and Morty comic book. We got a Steven Universe and the Crystal Gems comic book. And we got a mad comic book. Ooh, this is a good book. Every day. This, this is definitely worth by a David Levitin. By this guy? Definitely worth a read. Uh, just joking. Hmm? Gotta keep the old funny bone a tickling. 
Um, I'm not going to read this. This was just for an Easter egg sort of thing, so I'm just going to put this in the put away pile. Um, How to Do More Than Just About Everything by... I don't know. Uh, obviously, I gotta have the dangerous book for boys. Wait a minute, hold on. If you are in Sir Euline, Kentucky, by August 21st, 2017, you can have the... You can have a... You can have an amazing view of the solar eclipse. Uh, apparently, this was planned in April 30th, 2014. Um, this is a Lego minifigure year-by-year -year book. I think I will give this to Kate. An instruction manual for my lamp. That's going in the trash. Uh, a lot of these are educational books. I'll mostly math. Uh, this is my second five-year journal, although I still gotta finish the first one. This is a teenage book, a teenage guide to sexuality. Um, I have to put that one back on the normal shelf. There's another book. Uh, ooh! Crack in the Line by Michael Lawrence. What was it about again? Yeah, I remember this one. Alaric and Naya. Naya? Naya. I remember Alaric, but Naya? This is an interesting one. I guess I'll keep that one. This is a Lego stamp thing. This one is very, oh, pen. Nice. Keep that one for later. This one, I tried to do something cool with the whole Gravity Falls thing. Did not work too well with the first one, so I put two rings on it. Uh, let's see, what else? Uh, this one, I made this in 2014. I started it, but there are some pages missing. Clearly, I did not want to keep that information. Let's see. Oh, no, wait, this is a dream journal I had. I gotta reread these. This is like some weird stuff. I can't remember much, but I remember the best part. I was barefoot and it was going to water the. I was barefoot and was going to water the plants. I could feel the mud on my feet. I just, actually, I remember a little bit of that, because you know how when you're dreaming a dream, you can feel everything as if it was real, as if it was actually happening. I continue to be amazed by how awesome dreams can be. Uh, ooh, a pencil. Which doesn't have anything. Trash. Okay. Ooh. Oh, boy. This is my driver's ed thing. What is this? Oh boy. Oh dear. This is like very detailed stuff about how to drive. Like look at this. I have like, no oh, shoot. I have like diagrams and whatnot. This is how I took notes back then? This is crazy. I don't I don't even remember writing half of this stuff. Uh, this is a continuation of cracking the line. Oh, yeah, I actually finished this one. This is like... This is like the... This is the first one, this is the second one. And I think there is a third one. They say as you get older, your mind starts to go, but that's normally in, like, your senior years, like... Not in senior as in school, but senior as in, like, senior citizen. However, I feel like I am both. Like, a lot of my, a lot of my body parts are hurting a little bit. Although I've kind of gotten used to it by now. 
Oh, Neil Patrick Harrison's Choose Your Own Autobiography. I gotta, gotta give that one a read sometime. Uh, this one is one of those secret hidden books. I'll just put that there. Uh, let's see. This is another minifigure book, which I'm going to give to Kate. And this one is the... The Lego Adventure Book, where you go on an adventure and you learn how to build Legos. This is, ooh, jumbo playing cards. I gotta, when we're going through the apocalypse, I know what to get. And it is around bedtime, so I'm going to leave this video here and bring it back. So why don't we do this whole hand transition. <laughs>